How's it going, gamers? My name is Chris. Oh, shit. No, that, that's Chris. I'm Dan. Uh, welcome to, uh, what, where are we? EBX. EBX Mario. I thought I'd remember that. Damn it. 2013. EBX Mario 2013. And uh, Chris already seen Hello, friends of his. Hello. Hey, Chris's Hello. friends. Friends. Um, yes. We'll so welcome today. to, uh, EB Expo with uh, Gamers Inc and such. So, wow, this place looks good. I'm going to show you guys what we're doing here. So, they've got Nintendo 3DS, or Nintendo in general, hanging around here, Pokemon X and Y. We've got Razer over there, War Gaming. Not as much of an elaborate setup as last year, but uh, still not bad for what it is. Uh, Disney Infinity, pretty standard setup. Skylanders is exactly the same as where it was last year. Um, this place looks really nice actually, so we're gonna go check it out. I got Gavin here. Hey! Gamers Inc. with and me and Kelly buddy. and Kelly. Kelly, my girlfriend's trying to duck from the camera so I won't force her into the frame. Uh, beyond that, yeah, we got uh, EA's all set up here. We got FIFA, Sims. Um, oh shit, I zoomed in. That's my bad. I zoomed in again. Yeah, Battlefield 4 around the corner here. We got PlayStation all set up. Very, very nice. Assassin's Creed has a particularly similar setup as they did last year. But uh, yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna have a look around and we'll come back if anything interesting happens. So uh, see you soon. Bye. Hey all. So we just gave uh, Battlefield 4 a go. We played a team of uh, what was it 15 on 15 something like that. Uh, just had an intense battle and uh, it was a blue rate. Was a uh, blue ration saying was the game type. And it was pretty intense, you know. The level had like trenches and all that shit walk around. And uh, you burned through ammo pretty quickly, but uh, hey Blake, what'd you think? Battlefield 4? Happy with it? Amazing. Okay, well, we're gonna go home and play the beta in the next few days, so um, I don't know, so I'm gonna give it a go. Uh, Forza is with this impression now, Xbox One booth. So, I don't know, it's Forza and. It's like it's like a fight game, I'll show you. Oh, Holy moly, yeah. what is this? I went into this. What is? It's, oh, everyone's game attacks run here, is it? Ah, uh, no, people oh, that went into it. Hey, shout out to these people. It's on the Xbox One uh, Holden. And it's registered to 2014, which is strange because I didn't even know the registration to make sure it exists. It doesn't, it's a bit blurry, so I'm gonna leave it. But yeah, they're showing off uh, Forza 5 here. Hey, the stick is on there. Good job, buddy. But yeah, so, all in all, Battlefield 4, approval. Alright, so going on behind me is uh, Batman Arkham Origins. So I've just had a look there at the little preview they're doing. Yeah, it's pretty much reconstructing a crime scene of a, of a helicopter crash or something like that. Uh, just at a first glance, it looks like a good game. Uh, I've had recommendations from a couple people, including Mr. Matty Mouse, so I can trust his recommendations on that. But at the same time, I'm a little bit questionable of its replayability because I've played games like that and it just hasn't done it for me for playing it more than once. So we'll see about that and I'll consider it for my next um, game release. So yeah, check it out. Hello? Is that really in my face? Yes, sort okay. of. No, there we're good. There we're good? Okay, cool. Hi guys, yeah, um, so we're just going off to a mate's car to drop some stuff off. So much swag. We've been, uh, playing, where are you putting that camera? On the, on the card, on the card, <laughs> right on the card. Okay. Might have to cut mate, that out. Mate, I'm gonna have to do some serious editing after this shit. Make sure I don't walk into the water. It's all good. No, I'll let you know when you're getting close to it. Look at all the swag. Yeah, we've, we've got some stuff. That's my jumper, so it's nothing new. Get rid of that. Uh, That's some, what I some got. Posters. Breaking Bad. Breaking Bad. Minecraft posters. Hell yeah, why not? Mugs. Woo! What, um... Stop in the name of my pickaxe. Yeah, uh, we upgraded our swords and pickaxes. I have a sword. I'm diamond gonna come sword. back for a, uh, a diamond pickaxe tomorrow, yeah, so... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, um, we're gonna take a walk through this uh, giant tower of water. I'm gonna make sure I don't walk backwards through. No, it. we're gonna walk into the water. <laughs> no, we're not. I'm gonna keep it's talking. The the no, we're not. I'm gonna keep this sentence going until we're gonna end up. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. All right, guys, we're heading back into um, the main pavilion to check out. Uh, Watch Dogs and maybe a couple other games, Xbox One. Thank you. Yeah, appreciate it. So we're going to, um, yeah, we're going to find the rest of the boys later. They've gone to lunch somewhere different, so. Yeah, all right. Light change. There we go. So, hey, we're going to go have some fun and let you know what I think of Watch Dogs. We've checked out uh, Wargaming. They're doing a um, very, very serious Asian League uh, semi-final series, so we'll check that out. A little bit later, it was Mind Freak versus uh, Avant Garde. Uh, oh, it's getting busy here. So they brought uh, just dance back over here now to the Nintendo booth. They got Razor. Now I know what's here now. I've had a look at it a little bit more. They got Wargaming over there doing the. They seem to have taken the series. 
coming back avant-garde nodes. They've moved on. Sea cucumbers versus uh, cherry pickers. So that'll be the second semi-final. Uh, we got Alienware over there. I'm gonna check that out a little bit later. See if we can get another T-shirt, another year, another year, another T-shirt. Why not? Disney Infinity appear to be here as well. They're just across the way from their good friends slash enemies, Skylanders. Same thing, but not. So yeah. PlayStation is very elaborate with a, a two-story setup right here. So uh, we'll be sure to take a look at that a little bit later. But yeah, that's pretty much it. We got PA, as I've mentioned, over to my side. Sorry, I should move out. Uh, our good friend Jigsy, no EA. Uh, he's standing up top of the Battlefield 4 tank. I'll see if I can get a shot of him when we approach him in about 30 seconds. So yeah, uh, later on today, we'll probably skip Assassin's Creed uh, 4 for today. Uh, oh, this is cool. Um, up here they've got a Assassin's Creed Black Flag uh, painting that's actually been painted. It was being painted live. It seems to be stopped for now. But uh, here's what it looks like at the end of day one. Or the, the middle of day one, anyway. So that's going to be auctioned for charity at uh, facebook.com forward slash Ubisoft Australia. It's for uh, charity. It's for uh, Starlight Foundation. So very nice. Very nice indeed. Uh, here we go. Jigsy's up here. Up on the Battlefield 4 tank. Jigsy, I'll stalk you on Twitter later, buddy. Oh, good. Very nice. They've gone very, very all out. A lot of tanks had the tank last time, and now EA has stolen it from about before. Great idea. Um, hey, we'll go check out Watch Dogs. We'll be back. Oh my god, he's back again. We just checked out Watch Dogs. Holy crap, that looks good. Uh, multiplayer integration, it's probably not going to be what I thought it would be like, but um, still looks good either way. I pre-ordered the Xbox One. Watch Dogs is going to be a game I'm getting directly for Xbox One. So, uh, yeah. Kelly, can Xbox One? Hi! Okay, hi is the answer. Hi is the answer. Okay, we're back again. Game of Zinc, bloody EB Expo yeah. coverage. Uh, I can't really see. Yeah, it's fine. Let's go with it. So, uh, yeah. Hey, Blake. How you doing? Hey, Aaron. Hey, how you going? I'm, I'm not too bad. How you doing? Okay, so we've had a, a bit of a runaround. I think the last time I vlogged it was uh, Watch Dogs, the Watch Dogs preview. That, that was really nice, so very polished, very, very nice. Uh, look forward to seeing that in a few episodes at home. A few episodes, what? I'm getting that on the Xbox One, I think I mentioned that. Cool. But hey, yeah, uh, since then, we I found these clowns over in the Xbox One. Woo! Yeah, my point exactly. In the Xbox One uh, section, and they give you these uh, Xbox One passes. Uh, basically, you scan them and you go into the running for some free swag. So, you know, why not? Why not? It's worth it. Uh, I gave uh, Forza 5 a bit of a try. I did a lap or two of one of the races. Looks really nice. And it was good to actually get my hands on the console for once. I tried out the Xbox One controller. I spent a lot of the, that race actually just feeling out the controller, seeing what it was like. It's, uh, as they say, it's a lot thinner than the original Xbox. It's not as chunky. There's no battery pack. And the, the knobs on the controller as well have the really thick uh, padding on the, the sides, not so much the middle, so your thumb really will stay there when, uh, when you're using it. I'm um, rather curious to see over time if that wears down or what's going to happen with that. Um, yeah, but it seems like a really, really decent system, uh, controller there. And really, the entire system looks really good, so hence the pre-order. But hey, so we've pretty much resulted to... Um, doing nothing now. We just watched uh, Jigsy from EA. You stand on top of a Battlefield 4 tank firing t-shirts out of a t-shirt cannon. Cool check, ever. check my vine. I posted one just now. It looks pretty good. And um, yeah, so since then we've just pretty much sat around and we're, we're waiting for the next session. So it's... Half an hour to Call of Duty, I think. So yeah. Yeah, so it'll close at 2... Uh, 3? Closes at 3. They kick everyone out. Opens at 4 again. Yep. Yeah, so we get an hour break. I'm going to sit here and play with my diamond sword or, you know, read Game of Thrones or something. I'm reading the books. Pretty good stuff. Pretty good stuff. Enjoying it. Oh, man, they're long. Man, they're long. But hey, that's that's me, so... I don't know. Holmes is around somewhere. He's gonna head over and hang out because we're the front of the line for the next session, so... I'm gonna head over to Call of 
Judy. Part of the plan there. There's something about stage editions. Uh, first 500, or not the first 500. 100 of each session. Yeah, 100 in each session. Uh, go with the chance to win a prestige edition. So yeah. There we go. So yeah, that's pretty much going to be everything. And well, we'll see how we go about that. And whether it's a win one or a chance to win one, we'll find out. But hey, that's us. We'll come back for more EB Expo day one. Don't go anywhere. Brace yourselves! Oh! Ah! Jesus. Winter is coming. Yeah. So we're going to go head over to Call of Duty know, and like, uh, oh, run guys! Damn. No, Alright, well, we just came from uh, Call of Duty Ghosts. Uh, I, had, I had an insanely good game, which is really strange for someone who never does well in a shooter. Um, Blake, do you want to tell them your bad news? Fuck you. How many deaths? I can't remember. More than 10. More than 10. I had, uh, I had a 19 kills to 3 deaths, 7 assists, which is fucking insane. What the fuck happened, man? Uh, I did pretty good, uh, 12 to 10, but I thoroughly enjoyed it, and was pretty much 3rd or 2nd in the entire game, so yeah. I had no fucking idea what the game time was. Cranked. Uh, you had to kill someone within 30 seconds, and if you did, the timer reset back to 30 seconds. If you didn't, you would have explained at the end of it. Okay. That's how All I right. saw it. Seems pretty standard, I have no fucking idea what you said, but hey, not bad, so I'll consider it, I'll consider it. If I had a bad game, I would not have considered it, I'm not gonna lie. But hey, maybe. Xbox One, we played it on the Xbox One. Were we impressed with the handling of the, cons uh, the controller and the console you guys itself? Have a it was, the controls weren't the way I set it up to be, but yeah, I was happy with it. Okay. Okay. It was preset. Yeah, yeah. yeah well, you, you can't change it. Did you guys have impulse triggers though? On the uh, Okay, so that's it. That's the end of day one for EB Expo. I'm not sure why I'm wrapping it up because I haven't even finished telling you about the rest of my day. <laughs> Holy crap. So, what did, where did I lo the, off the break? We. Where did we go? Where's the Call of Duty? Call of Duty, Call of Duty Ghosts. Uh, I've already spoken about this actually. Yeah, the, the. Yeah. I had a good round and I'm happy I may buy it. Uh, after that, we went to the Xbox One. Anything between that? No? Um, I don't really, think so. But we did uh, did get in the chance to win one of 500 Prestige Edition. And yeah, we yeah. Win, we didn't win a single thing. I was giving away tomorrow. codes. I was giving away codes for something they for, were the, for the people that won yeah. the QR code system. But hey, never know. We may win tomorrow. And Yeah, two days yeah. left. But uh, after that, we tried out uh, a couple of games on the Xbox One. I had a game of... Rise? Was it Rise, the first one we played? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. It was Rise, Rise. It Rise with R. a Y. Rise with a Y. Uh, that was a pretty good title. That's a launch title for Xbox One, by the way. Uh, it was a, it's literally, it's like Chivalry Arena, but you're, I, we did a co-op mode where it was me and my girlfriend versus like, oh, horde of waves. enemies, waves, waves of enemies, hordes, waves, whatever you want to call it. Hordes are for zombies. Waves are, no, we didn't. Are you a wave of zombies? Yes, Apparently. I got 1,200 kills of zombies. Yeah, how did you go in Call of Duty, Blake? They played Dead Rising. Blake Seven. had a really I'll shockingly bad KD of Call of Duty. But, um... I might be waiting till you're dead, but... Yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, okay. And then after that, uh, they played... Thanks, Lewis. Love you, man. Ah! Uh, they played Dead Rising. A lot of zombies were dead. Eventually, they were dead. And then, here we are. We're heading home. We're going to the pub. Why not? Get something to eat. Snitzel. Yeah, Snitty, why not? And beer. Yeah. Anyway, we're walking past the football stadium, so if you hear any loud noises, that's them still trialing out sounds, because I'm pretty sure there's no sports going on at the moment. Who knows? But hey, that's pretty much it. I'll be back tomorrow for day two if I remember to vlog a lot more, because I know day two is a lot you less vloggy than day one. Me. Gab will remind me, so you will see day two content. Yay! And beyond that, hey, this has been Dan. That's Lewis. That's Aaron. That's Gavin. That's Blake. That, that's that's Try Run. That's Blake, that's Gavin, and that's Kelly hiding behind Gavin because she doesn't move on the camera. Hey, bye!